Hey, it's Tori Hornsby with Tesla Tips and Tricks. Today I'm driving in a 2021 Tesla Model Y Performance. A common question we see in our group is what's the difference between autopilot and full self-drive and auto steer? And I want to address that today. So on the screen, you can actually see I've got my autopilot features. And all of these are autopilot. So what we see a lot in the group is people saying autopilot or full self-drive. What they're meaning is auto steer or full self-drive because technically full self-drive and auto steer are both autopilot features as you can see on the screen here. So uh, the difference between these two is with auto steer, the car will drive for you uh, in a straight line. It will maneuver around traffic. If traffic slows down in one lane, it'll get over for you, turn on the blinker, and it will, it will maintain the road as you roll. Now, what full self-drive does is it actually takes that to a, a much higher degree and drives the car for you. And if you put a in a destination in your navigation and you have full self-drive on, it'll make all the turns for you. It'll, it'll handle everything to where auto steer will just do that on the road that you're on. It'll just keep it on the one straight road until you turn, then you would have to reactivate it again because uh, when you take over from auto steer, it, it cancels it. Unlike, you know, full self-driving where uh, it'll, it'll navigate everything for you if, if you let it. Just a note, it's supervised. Don't expect that this isn't going to, to not have certain issues at a red light or at a stop sign. It, it's not perfect yet. That's why they call it supervised, but have fun with it. I, to, in my opinion, it's one of the best features and one of the biggest reasons to drive a Tesla.